Short Music Label. I'm Chuck Foster, you're listening to Reggae Central on KPFK, and I'm very pleased to welcome in the studio, honored in fact, to welcome Mr. Everton Blender. Welcome to Reggae Central. Blessed love, man, and I would give thanks to you know, the young and the whole and the disabled Everton Blender, so may you guide and protect them all in their going out and they're coming in from this time forth and forevermore, you know. One love, you know, blessed, perfect love, you know. Great to see you down at the Seabreeze Festival yesterday, playing some of the classic Everton Blender tunes. Yeah, yeah. Wonderful. It was well, nice uh, to be there, you know. I know your, uh, your history in reggae music is kind of unusual because you were involved in the music really before, uh, for years before I became aware of you as a recording artist. And I wanted to ask you about your early days, your early days in the music. You worked on sound systems? Well, yeah, we used to work on a lot of sound systems. We used to work on sound systems like Aqua, Papa Leo, um, we used to sing on Gemini, we used to sing on um, Emperor Lord Fate, we used to sing on Youth Man Promotion, we used to sing on Papa Roots, you know, we used to sing on uh, Santex, wow. you know, Destiny, you know, there's a lot of sound, you know, who don't hear them name because I don't know, a blessed <laughs> love singing, you know. So how, how far back, how, around what year would you have started singing on sound systems? Well, right now, trust me, we start singing on sound system from 1980, you know. Wow. Okay. You know, but really, people never really recognize us, you know. And were you using the name Everton Blender back then? No, we used to sing as Everton Williams. Everton Williams? Yeah, because um, we used to sing a song for, um, in 1980, I did, I did, uh, did my first recording, um, Where Is Love, huh. with, um, with um, Eric Bubbles. He was the one that was with... Um, I think it African was Brothers, Africa, yeah, Af yes. ah, African yes. Brothers, Tony Tuff, and yeah, uh, Cedric Martin, yeah. yeah, and then I did I did a next song um, with with um, this this producer. Uh, I think it's RJ. Ah, yes, RJ. Yeah, I did a song. Um, I think it's one a jumbo jet, and I did a, um, I think I did a classic um, Ria Mino. Uh huh. You used to have a, um, I think with Gilbert. I think in, in that time, Copper TV came with a song name, um, it was the 6 after 6, 1986. Uh -huh. And I come with one entitled, uh, is that more classic, you know, Ria Mino? Uh -huh. Yeah, you know, so. What's it called? We, uh, my, uh, Ria Mino. Ria Mino. Yeah, that's, that's the river that joined one of our fellow brethren. Oh, yeah. You know, so we used to sing a song, a spiritual song for him, you know. We right. never really sing it as a dancer, we just sing it as a classic. And was that also under the name Everton Williams? Yeah, that was um, yeah, that was under the name Everton Williams. But that's not your real name. Like, yeah, that's that's my real name. Ah. But um, um, in 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 those days, you know, people looked at me and said, um, I can't sing on, by that name because it's my real name. If I have a stage name, because I used to <laughs> sing on, I used to sing on Stereo Mars and. Uh -huh. You know, when, when this, this youth um, was introducing me, Arthur Baden, he died about four years ago. Uh -huh. Arthur Baden invited me over to Steromar Sound and it was Nicodemus who was at the control. So they said, I'm a singer. He said, what's your name, youth? He said, my name is Everton Williams. He said, Everton Williams. I said, sing a name but Everton Williams. <laughs> anyway, come in Everton Williams and we sing a Bob Marley song. Oh, uh -huh. listen, people, listen. I'm not telling them all the place go wild, man. And, Broke out, you know. Uh -huh. Yeah, so we are singing from a very good time, and you know. But since since we get real recognition, you know, it's nineteen late ninety one, ninety two when I did uh, right. create a song. And this is when you were writing your own material too. In the early yeah, days, you were you know, singing 